So this is what uh, some of the afternoon highs they had today. 40 in Dallas, 33, that's in Kansas City, 32 in St. Louis, 31 in Memphis. Now you'll probably remember a couple days ago those temperatures were not even above freezing. So they're not looking at snowfall currently right now, but they still have very cold temperatures moving into the area overnight tonight. And here's a look at the hard freeze warning through parts of the Rio Grande and moving into parts of Louisiana, also parts of Mississippi and also moving into parts of Arkansas. The concern is they're going to be looking at temperatures below 20 degrees for an extended period of time. So that does not bode well for those frozen uh, plumbing issues that they're dealing with. Those frozen pipes, that's still going to be something they're watching for overnight tonight with very cold temperatures. Temperatures should begin to moderate as they move into the weekend, though, and they should see some major improvement. Here's a look at the radar. We have a few light snow showers on the northern end of the state, but I do believe that most of us will be relatively dry except for the Sierra. Here's a look at current conditions. Looking out toward the Gilmore backyard with the mid 50s in Sacramento, 59 degrees in Stockton, 61 in Modesto, and near 40 degrees degrees in Tahoe. Weather headlines, lingering snow for the Sierra, another storm coming in tomorrow morning, and near record high temperatures in the forecast next five, uh, next uh, week. <laughs> so for the next five days, mind you, when could we see those record high temperatures? Take a look. Monday and Tuesday afternoon highs expected to be in the lower 70s. Record for those days are more like the mid 70s. So we're flirting, so to speak. Here's a look at what will be happening. Another storm system coming in around midnight hitting the coastline. It's going to be moving through our area fairly swiftly. Not a whole big, mm, big rain amount that we're expecting, but the opportunity for snow showers will be in the forecast of parts of the Sierra. Again, not a huge weather maker, but still an opportunity to give you some slick roadways. Here's a look at a beautiful sunset sent in by Sharon Givens. If you have a nice photo you'd like to share, you can always upload it to the ABC 10 app. And those temperatures are going to warm very nicely Monday and Tuesday, but they're a little non-committal. We'll be back in the mid-60s by Wednesday.